And a German shipping giant, Hapag Lloyd, has launched its fast container vessel that will be serving the East African region and Asia. The cargo ship docked which at, at the port of Mombasa on Sunday will also be heading, heading to the port of Dar es Salaam to complete its voyage. The company will be deploying seven 2,800 TEU vessels in the new service. NTV's Kevin Mutai has more on this. The Northern Valence called the port of Mombasa on Sunday for the first time under the new service known as East Africa 3 that will be connecting the region to some of the leading ports in Asia. The vessel deployed by Hapag Lloyd, which is a German-based shipping company, is expected to significantly boost port business at a time when the industry is recovering from the effects of COVID-19. We witnessed a drop in the number of vessels calling the port and a decline in operational performance. However, like many ports globally, we have since recovered and are witnessing a positive growth outlook in our performance. This first voyage started its journey from Shanghai, China on April 2021 with the Kenya Ports Authority revealing that the ship will be on a weekly rotational sailing in the ESC with a fleet of 237 modern container vessels and a total of transport capacity of 1.7 million TEUs Hapag Lloyd is one of the world's leading shipping line companies. It goes to Port Kelang, it goes to Singapore, uh, then it goes to Shanghai, it makes a direct call at uh, Nansha, uh, Ningbo, and uh, so it's, it's primarily the Far East service, and, uh, and, and from, from the Far East to East Africa, it's one of the fastest services. Talks are also underway for the new shipping line to tap on the new market chain presented by the port of Lamu, targeting South Sudan and Ethiopia. The port is very ideal for transshipment cargo into the Indian Ocean Islands, owing to its great depths of 17 meters alongside, capable of accumulating fourth accommodating fourth generation of ships. The infrastructure is still undergoing a lot of development and I'm sure um, uh, it will pave way for us to relook at uh, the, uh, the, uh, you know, the market demand and, and then change our services. So at this moment, we are only with Mombasa. This now means that Kenya will be directly connected to some of the largest and ultra-modern facilities in the world, such as the ports of Singapore and Shanghai and the northern Valence is expected in Dar es Salaam today. She offloaded 426 and loaded 387 TEUs at the port of Mombasa. Kevin Mutai, NTV, in Mombasa.